For the dowel or golf club, core emphasized standing pelvic tilt. The first concept I want you to think of is that your pelvis in a perfectly neutral position is like a bucket of water. We got water in it, water's not spilling out, but if I push my belt buckle forward and down, water spills backwards, go back to neutral. If I pull it backwards, water spills out behind me. When we address our golf ball, into our six iron posture, whatever posture we're doing, we want to maintain that neutral pelvis. Most of us don't know what our pelvis is. We don't have the awareness of it. So this drill is to kind of help you get awareness. So you're going to place your golf ball, your dowel on the floor, hinge back like you're addressing like your six iron. And then we want you to go through maximum pelvic tilt. So push your belt buckle all the way forward. That's where you need to arch. This would be like an S posture. I can pull it all the way back and I kind of get my, feel my abs in this one. And I kind of go into that C posture. Okay, so you can see how the pelvis can dictate our postures. Basically what we want you to do is hold that dowel or golf club down, move through that pelvis through all the way through the end ranges, forward, backward, forward, middle, and then recognize and be aware of where that middle is so that the next time you go down to address that golf club, you can stay in that neutral posture, helping your posture uh, through that position will unlock more of your core, keeping your body more connected, having you uh, be able to unleash more power in your golf swing. So that's a dowel or golf club, core emphasized pelvic tilt.